everyone! Today I will be teaching you one of the most basic macrame knots there is to know. The square knot. Let's get started. To begin, go ahead and attach two cords to a dowel rod with a lark's head knot. Now, to tie a right facing square knot, I'm going to take the cord all the way on the far right and I'm going to cross it over the two cords in the middle. You'll notice I formed a loop here on the side. I like to take my fingers and just kind of pinch the middle where everything crosses to hold my place. Then I take the cord on the very far left and I'm going to send it over that cord that was on the right. I send it all the way behind the two cords in the middle and then pull it up through the loop. Then you can take both ends of your cord and pull on them gently together to tighten up the knot. This is a half square knot. Now we're going to finish out our square knot by this time taking the cord on the left side and crossing it over the two cords in the middle to form our loop. Again, I pinch it where everything kind of connects to hold my place. Then the cord on the right side crosses over that left cord. I send it behind the two cords in the middle and pull it up through the loop. Then pull on those two ends gently together to tighten up the knot. And that is how you tie a full right facing square knot. And then to just keep tying more of these knots, we repeat, starting again on the right side. Also start your square knots on the left side, which is called left facing square knots. So all you do in this case is your first square knot starts on the left side. So you take that left cord to cross over your two cords in the middle to form a loop. Then the side on the right goes over the left, behind the two in the middle, and up through the loop. Pull on those to tighten. Then we take the right side to cross over the two cords in the middle to form the loop. The side on the left goes over the right, behind the two in the middle, and up through the loop. Pull it nice and tight. So as you can see, the face of our square knot is on the left side. And that is the only difference between right facing and left facing knots. And then of course, we keep repeating. If you enjoyed this video and would like to learn more, then please check out my online macrame classes. You will learn many tips, tricks, knots, and even full projects in my class. I hope to see you all there. So I hope you guys found this video helpful and inspiring and thank you so much for watching.